The adventurers prepare to disembark for a day to recover the tree stands. It should only be about what a half or a, yeah half mile away. We're yeah. Assuming it'll be about a half mile in that that uh. That direction. General direction. Over that it looks next like there ridge, might be maybe. another ridge behind that, though. That might be the ridge you're thinking of. Right. So we might have to go over a couple of hills. Uh, yeah, but it's it shouldn't okay. Shouldn't be too bad. Better than the two miles from Better coming in the other direction. In the eye. That's true. That uh, the uh, you know the road Deckerville got way too snowy, so we're gonna end up having to turn around and go out. But this is what we got. I mean, we it the road's not bad into this place at least. Nope. No, no, no. All right. We'll Alrighty. see you on the trip, guys. I mean, hatchet sledding is pretty juggalo. Huh? Huh? You got it, John? You okay? Yeah. Where are you going down at? I'm just right, right here. here. You guys seriously? Yeah, I'll hold the hatchet. I don't. You know, I was just kidding. <laughs> I was too. Yeah. He's gonna sled, but he's not gonna hatchet sled. We don't need any juggalos around here, unless they're watching our channel. In which case, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Whoop whoop. I a whoop whoop. <laughs> Ninja. Let her rip. Oh, we've come some ways. Got some more ways to go. Tom and I are a little bit jealous of John's snowshoes over here. Mr. Fancy Pants. What can I say? With his flip flops, the snow flip flops, is floating over flip the snow. Is. We got we got a ways to go that that way somewhere. Hooray! I made it. We made it. My stand's just up over there. Coming down in the field from that trail I've been staring at from my stand for months. It's a much easier way in and out. Glad to be back. Oh, you guys, we're right on top of that marker now. No, actually, we're not. We're way south of it. it must be your stand that's not the marker. It's no, the my stand's head. over there. Oh, it's the trailhead. Yeah, it's the tip of the trail. I see. Because where the trail we're on, on, we're on this trail goes back to that <laughs> uh, other road that we come in on. So, in the summer, or when you guys were deer hunting, did you, were you able to drive all the way back here? No. 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 We hiked every single piece of gear in, two and a half miles. I don't think there is. I think it's just a real tall set first step. Huh? I think it's just a real tall first step. Oh, just got to unfreeze those feet from the ground. Didn't get mine unfrozen. Had to leave the uh, bottom ladder section in. Put the stands down, and that's the legal part. And so in the spring, I can get back out and get it. Tom sure is helpful. Super glad he came out to help. He didn't even hunt out here this year. You come hunting with us next year? Yeah, sure, maybe. Yeah. See, see how much vacation time I got left. Yeah, that's the real <laughs> problem by the end, right? Usually. Are you hopeful, John? I mean, we'll see. Probably not. Timber. Oh, the internet likes nuts. <laughs> there we go, tree stand down, legal. Oh man, we forgot a wrench to take John's stand apart, so we're gonna have to drag it back to the car like this. Good times. Oh yeah, I thought we were gonna have to put it on the roof like no, this. Oh, thank God. Yay, top. That'd be hard to navigate them trails. Yeah, I was like, man, I don't know what we're doing once we get there, but she's down. And there we go. John's just setting out his stand. It works! Here's yep. asshole number one. Yeah, that's, this is asshole number one. Look at, there's the top. 
all the way down to his feet, ready to go. And then here's asshole number two. He was asking for help, but now he's being a man and doing it himself. Good for him. Yeah, how'd you do it by yourself all of a sudden? You God. needed help. He must have grew a pair. That's good. On camera. It's crazy camera. how that happens. It's funny how that happens. Yeah, we're going to hit the trail, man. <laughs> all we're saying is some of you have never sledded out an entire ladder stand assembled through two feet of snow and down trees. And it shows. We're just hiking it out, man. We're just making it work, lip by bit. Good thing Tom's here, man. We couldn't have done it without him. Yeah, throw that over here. Beautiful. Oh man, that was butter. Silky. How'd you get over? Lower, lower. Lower? There you go. Hey, perfect. You know, when life gives you obstacles, you make poor decisions. <laughs> this is a fine decision! Careful of the ladder when you're getting over that log. On account of our obstacles. I'd twist 180. Well, I gotta go under this. Yeah, but you're, you're too long. What do you mean I'm too long? Up and down. There you go, you got it. Lower. There you go, perfect. You're there. Now you tell me which is easier. The sled or the backpack? Good thing you're wearing sleeves, eh? Feeling moist? Nicely done. No, because I'm frozen. It's not moist anymore. Here. Thank you. You're welcome. There's a blanket now or a towel. Some folks. How you guys doing? Cheney. Sweaty. Martin, though, not Charlie. We have come quite the, uh, Quite the ways, and we still got a little ways to go. You okay? Well, here we are. We made it, man. Cars right up there. Got that one last big hill. Tom's helping John with his stand because John got smacked in the head. We made it. That's the important part. Gorgeous day for it. It's looking nice out. So there we go. Got them all strapped up on top of Tom's Jeep there. Gonna get them back, throw them in the trailer to go back home. It was quite the trip. Quite the journey down around there, up there, over through there, and then off into the woods. And around? Uphill both ways. Uphill. It was, oddly enough, in somehow snow. in the snow, in the snow it was uphill both ways. This is, this is must be how Grandpa got to school. Man, the 40 sucked. We should uh, go back to camp and check out Dick and the Dog. Oh my God, we should do a TV show just called Dick and the Dog. <laughs> it's just about Dick being lazy. <laughs> yeah, it's just about Dick being lazy. <laughs> oh, pretty good time. Glad we got the tree stands down. Not too bad. Doing pretty good. Looking forward to getting back to camp. What are you gonna do when you get back to camp? Oh, get naked and drink some water. Oh my god, I can't wait to get naked and drink some water. I'm Sounds also gonna like make the right thing to do. I'm also gonna make a sandwich. Again, book a feast, eating, drinking some water, getting rehydrated, getting geared up. Dick chopped a bunch of wood while we were gone, kept the fire going. Yeah, he did work, and my dog was safe. Hooray! Mm -hmm. And she glad we're back. So, yeah, we're just enjoying some lunch, and then you know, Tom's gonna drive out and call his wife, and we're gonna tell him that. Sounds cool. God, that sounds yeah, so yeah. dumb. God, yeah. and we're gonna my hang wife out. Is my mistress. Ah, uh, yeah, he's not. He's actually ignoring his wife this weekend and only calling his mistress. There you go. Sounds way cooler. Adventure.